Say hello to all my uninformed viewers. Ah, uh, I'm a Barbie girl in a Biden world. Has no one told you that you are old, Joe? For the 17th goddamn time, Joe, get the intro right. I am plastic, and it's fantastic. We already know that, Joe Biden, you are made of plastic, and you are not a human. I bet you touch Melania's plastic every single night, right, Donnie? You can't talk shit, Joe. Donnie, and they're off again. This time failed to survive 20 seconds of peace. Joe, you are literally covered in cocaine and plastic. And you eat plastic. Monkeys and chimpanzees, whose turn is it for this word? It's my turn, old man. Remember, I got the last round correct? We are going from bad to worse. And Donnie, stop calling people old. You are literally the second oldest person in this room. I only call it like I see it, and from where I'm standing, Joe's acting decades older than both of us. I'm not that old, only three and a half years older, Donnie. But to me, you sound like you're at least a century past your use-by date. Donnie, how about you start using that youthful brain of yours and come up with a five-letter word? Just to make you happy, Robot Rama, I've came up with my five-letter word, and it's something to do with humans. What if Donnie is trying to fool us and puts in that favorite word of his? Are you saying he put in bombs? Or are you saying he put in nukes? No, you illiterate people. If I put in that word, no humans would survive. It defeats the purpose you moron. Okay, how about this? I put in bombs. Then if I get it wrong, then one of you put in nukes. Sounds good? Yep, that is a good idea. You put in bombs, then we can get more clues of the word Trumpity Dumpity put in. Hooray, Obama-rama, you agree with my ideas? I'm a genius. The only thing you're a genius at is sniffing kids, sleeping and snorting cocaine just to stay awake, Joe. I'll order a Big Mac just to shut you up for two seconds, Donnie. Yes, please, go do it, do it now. Ordering food now. Joe, I reckon you should continue with your idea. Oh yeah, typing in bombs right now. I told you, cocaine sleepy Joe, the word is not bomb. Obama go type nook. Did you just try to mimic an African accent, Joe? Wait a second. This word cannot be nukes either because the S has been used and it's incorrect. Hurry up, Obama. No one wants to hear your nerdy robotic analysis. This word must have be something like, I'm the best, the greatest, something like that. The kind of things you think of when you think in Trumpy Rumpy's shoes. So you're saying Trump is not insulting anyone today? I don't think so, no. I mean, Trump did say this word has something to do with humans. There's not much insults he can throw out there, I believe. You guys will never guess what I am thinking. I think I will type in major because Trumpy Rump always think he is so big and important. He says stuff like, I'm the major of the best. This word also doesn't repeat much letters. At least you got the R correct, Obama de Lama. None of you are even close. I thought your brain was nerdy, Obama. It's my turn to guess now. You need to think inside of Donnie's brain, bushy wushy. And you need to learn to think Joe Biden. Anyway, now it's my turn, and I'm going to say what it is because I don't think Trump's brain gets very far in thinking. Number one, it has something to do with humans. And number two, it's not an intellectual word. Georgie bushy wushy, you old man, you gotta stop underestimating me. Did you forget who the real Wordle King is? I won the last Wordle competition, dumbass. And no, Donnie, I'll prove it to you that you are not so intelligent. Why on earth did you write next, Bushy? Because I'm not going to write in that word. The word? Don't tell me it is that word. Of course not, but I will give you guys one last hint. Okay, Donnie, what is that hint? The hint is that this word is an N word. We are not blind, Trump. We can see the N is green. I was saying that just in case cocaine Joe fell asleep again. I think I got it. Is the N word. I said that a second ago. That is copyright strike one Joe Biden. But I definitely got it. Donnie loves this N word and it's related to humans. Please, for the love of God, Joe, don't type in that N word. But I have to type in that N word. The word literally starts with an N. Can't you see Obama-rama? Just whatever you do. Don't type that N-word because you will get us demonetized. But I have to type in an N-word. Joe, don't you dare type that word in. I'm typing it in. Do you want to get canceled, sleepy cocaine Joe? Of course I don't want it, Donnie, but I'm typing in nukes. Oh, pew, I'm relieved. Haha, get pranked Obama-rama. Joe, your pranks are so bad, even five years old girls won't fall for it. Obama almost fell for Joe's prank, Donnie. That's because Obama is a robot and robots have no emotional intelligence. Screw you, Donnie. I've got the perfect word for my next guest to figure out your word. Yeah, do that, Barack. Then you can get more clues for Trumpy's word. No, you sleepy Joe. This is an ultra hard word. I will type in the word never. If we don't get the E and V, then it's obvious what word Trump was trying to type. You are such a nerd, Barack. It's obvious my word is an N word. Why did you put in that N word, Donnie? Because it has something to do with humans. Yeah, yeah no shit, Donnie. I'm typing in my word now. Wait, guys, I need your help for one thing. What is it, grumpy Trumpy? Do you need help getting out of your chair? No, I need help because I just forgot how to pronounce that word. Let's move on, guys. Donnie is just playing stupid. Now, I'm being serious, how do you pronounce that word N-I-G-E-R? Is it knee or lie, and does it end in gar or jer? Good point, Donnie. I honestly don't even know. Wait, I thought Obama would know this word best. Now Obama's playing dumb, huh? So if Obama doesn't even know, then you need to trust me on the pronunciations because I put in that word. Let me help you out, Donnie. The word is pronounced as Niger. So the country has one G and the N-word has two Gs, right? I'm absolutely speechless. Wait, Barack, are you saying the word is pronounced as Niger? Shut the fuck up, Donald. Let's move on to Bush's word. Finally, we can move on from Donald's whining. Shut your demented, ugly, skin cancer-looking face up, Joe. You whine more than me, and you are more stupid than me. And you are more orange, fat, chubby, obese obese, fake, criminal, racist, shit-haired, arrogant, ignorant, and most importantly, more incompetent than me. Your entire career, Joe, and the most memorable thing about you is me. Think about that. 
Also, I've got one word for you. Crack, look it up. Funny how you mentioned crack, Donnie. Maybe you're just reflecting on your hairline. Kids and babies. I got my six-letter word, and this is the perfect word to describe Trumpy Rumpy. Well, it's obvious that word. There's no other six-letter word that better represents me. Obviously, Bushy Wushy is talking about bigger because there's nobody bigger than me. Oh, please, Trumpy Rumpy, bigger? Did you really think Bush would put in a word for you to guess in your first guess? Ha, 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 poor Humpty Dumpty Trumpety. Not so intelligent anymore, huh? You guys are such crybabies. I have a strong feeling this word could be bomber. It can't be Grumpy Trumpy. Bush would never say anything flattering about you. Don't make me fall asleep, Sleepy Cocaine Joe. You're boring. You're just parroting what they're saying. Let's get on with it, folks. I'm kind of in a hurry. Are you seriously going to change your diapers again, Georgie Bushy? Don't mess with Bush, bro. At least he has some very high class. Thank you, Obama. It's good to know you're the only one in this room to still have some sense. No, Bushy, I've got the most sense, and that demented kid sniffer has the least amount of common sense in this room. Fuck you, Donnie. I don't sniff kids, and it's clear I have more intellect and common sense than your big grapefruit coconut head. When you fall asleep, Joe Biden, I will sneak into your house, put Jill to deep sleep, then I will start farting in your ears, piss in your nose, and poo in your mouth, you dirty, creepy, and senile crack addict. Don't you dare say this about my Jill, you Big Mac-infused orangutan with hairs of a sloth. You would run out of energy by the time you reach my doorbell diabetic criminal. And you Joe Biden. Boys, boys, let's get on with my guess. No, no bushy wushy. I was enjoying their toddler fights, man. I got the perfect word to describe Trumpy Rumpy. No way you got my word. It's Polish because Donnie looks clean from the outside, but your brain ain't got nothing inside. See, this is what I've been trying to say for a long time. Biden is not somebody who's in his right mind. That's why I should be reelected. Please, Donnie, let's not campaign now. The United States of America needs a tough, smart, tough leader who will lead them to economic growth, who will make them richer, say no to a government of leaks say no to a government of Biden. Biden means prostitute in an ancient language. Vote for Trump. Donnie, there's only one word that describe you and I will put in that word. Haha, <laughs> it has to be legend. I am a legend to come up with a speech on the top of my head. Trumpy Rumpy, I didn't hear a thing because I was taking my pills. Too bad you missed the best speech ever, Joe. All right, Donnie. The word I'm whacking in to describe your extraordinary actions today is... It's legend. I'm a legend. No, it's stupid. In fact, I think I should have typed in that word many episodes ago to describe you, Donnie. That insult should have been directed to Joe Biden. He is the stupidest person in this room. The fact you eat way too much McDonald's already makes you stupid. Imagine if none of you guessed this word. Then I can call all of you stupid. Wushy wushy, you just got lucky on the previous round. It's your turn, Donald. We're all waiting for your guess. I think Bushy Wushy is trying to trick us. He's saying this word describes me, but I think this word clearly describes Joe Biden, the creepy crackhead. Oh no, Donnie, you're gonna get your word wrong again. There's no way Bush will lie in his speech and what he says. Clearly, he's being seriously. Once again, I am a legend and I can read people's minds. I think the word is rapist, as in how Joe Biden raped little kids. <laughs> Why do you think I do that, Donnie? So you sound like Santa Claus when you reach climax, Joe? Uh, yeah, what the fuck was that sound you just made? Don't worry, I was listening to some Coco Melon. Kind of 80 year old watch Coco Melon. A wrinkly, pervy cocaine addict whose name is called Joe Biden. Fuck you, Donnie. I have the word to describe. Your criminal orange fat ass. You better not get this word wrong, Joe. There is literally only one option in here. Okay, Obama-rama. The word Bush put in that describes that orangutan is racist because this chubby chub was trying to be racist in the previous round. Joe Biden, can you not see the T at the end? Wishy wushy, that's the word you put in to describe me, huh? I'm only saying the truth, Grumpy Trumpy. We all know that's a fact, bro. And the final word is racism because Donnie the Humpity Dumpity is the most racist person in this room. Just because your chocolate and Michelle's triple chocolate, it does not make me a racist. Donnie, Barack, Bushy, which one of you said chalk chip ice cream?